25 teams started today in the gold fleet of the 49er FX Skiff, but in the end, the drama and the action all centered around two teams at the front of the fleet. It was the Swedish duo, Vilma Bobek and Rebecca Netzler, who were up against the German mixed crew. Sophie Steinlein from the Norddeutsche Regatta Verein is racing this week with her coach, the two-time bronze medal winner at the Olympics, Tommy Plössl from Hamburg. So, a variation from the Olympic norm of two women racing together in the FX, but mixed crews are permitted to race at Kielerbocke. And so today on the TV course, an exciting duel developed between the two teams across four gold fleet races. 10 to 15 knots of wind and a long wave pattern made for great sailing conditions. It soon became obvious that Steinlein and Bobek would be a good match for each other. On the upwind leg, Steinlein plus always eked out a small advantage. On the downwind, however, the Swedes turned up the heat and won the first two races of the day. The third race of the day was very dramatic. The two Swedes thought they were already the winners and sailed past the Germans, but didn't realize that the race committee had planned three rounds instead of only two. Bobek and Netzler sailed towards the supposed finish, but then had to unwind their mistake and sail back to the gate to rejoin the field from behind. Because of this mistake, the two women from the Royal Swedish Yacht Club finished sixth their worst result of the day, which means they sit in second place in the overall standings behind Steinlein and Plussel. The Swedish fight back begins tomorrow. Also on the FX race course were the Olympic silver medal winners in this class and multiple Kiel Week winners Tina Lutz and Suzanne Boyka. Today didn't really work out on day three of their farewell tour. A fourth place, a tenth and two elevenths was a mixed day for this accomplished team who now sit in sixth place overall. Tomorrow is another day of high speed on the TV course for the men's 49ers before the medal races which are scheduled for Sunday.